Okay, so here's the new and improved faceting machine. Isn't it cool? It's fantastic. Anyway, if you look, uh, you've got uh, the, diff the serum oxide, you've got different uh, grits of discs. Uh, you can see 240, 400, 800, 1200, 2000. And I have a little foam rubber little pad for the serum oxide. <clears throat> There's the computer box, it's got a display, it's got a uh, keyboard, there's computer junk inside, cables going to XY axis, a turret, and the rotator. And then this is the grinder wheel with a light, water, and you can see the water comes at the bottom. And that is for uh, switching the, the gemstone from one dob stick to the other. Uh, and then power supply. Okay, so let's turn this thing on. See if we can make that out. Let's do it again so you can see that. Maybe. Okay, so you see the light comes on. It says swirling brain faceting machine, and then it says manual control. And then if you click OK, right in the middle. I wish you could see that, but anyway, um, you can start moving around. So it's moving the x-axis, that moves the y-axis, so you got left, right, up, down, and then the bottom ones move the turret, and then the top ones, the ones up here, move the rotator, okay. And you can pick, there's little numbers up here, you can pick how many facets you want. So if you have uh, 16, then it turns slower. You pick uh, something like 8, uh, you get 8 faces around it. If you pick 4, uh, there again, you're going to get, you know, like emerald cut. Um, Anyway, you can do two. Uh, if you do one, now it's going to do tiny little steps. So you can see it's doing one. Well, it says 355. It's one 360. It's, I, I need to kind of figure out what to do with the software because I get really get 355. But anyway, it has a light and uh, let's see. I can turn it on and off. If I go to the configuration and click, uh, turn it off. Turn it back on, turn it off, turn it back on. I'm uh, not sure why I need to do that, but pretty much just leave it on. Um, and then, uh, okay, there's like an about. Can you see the about? So the swimming brain, get some bubble verses in there, yeah, whatever. Kind of neat. Um, oh, I can do uh, auto facet, which auto facet is kind of neat. Uh, you pick uh, how many facets you want, so let's say like eight facets. And I can go up and down and pick more if I want, I can, or less, you know, uh, you know, however many faces, but some quick numbers here, you can press numbers or up and down. Okay, so say eight, and then how many increments, that's how far it's going to move in each time, and one is very little. Uh, the uh, how many times you want it to repeat X, it's going to go back and forth how many times? I'm going to just say two, just for sure. Okay. I hope you can still see that. Okay. And then the Y repeats, there again, only one a couple times. And when it's ready, you hit OK. And so you hit OK, and it backs up, switches the rotation, goes back and forth. And there again, it's going to back up, rotate, go back and forth. I told it to go back and forth twice, remember? So go back and forth twice, back up. Now it scooted in a little bit this time. And then it goes back and forth. It's imperceptible how much it scooted in. Back up. Switch again. 
And of course, it's going to do that for all the fa faces. Uh, if you have some kind of thing happen or you want to quit, you can always hit escape and it backs up and stops. Uh, otherwise, it would have kept going. The uh, registration deal, if you can see it, I don't know if you can see it or not, but the idea is that you would have your gemstone glued onto the dob stick and you can scoot it in and then glue it to the other dob stick. And uh, one of the dob sticks has like a hole in the middle so you can do like the, the pavilion. Um, anyway, hope you enjoy that. This is really cool. I'm really happy. I can't wait for my mom to try it out. Now, this is the first real one uh, that I've made. That's not just do it yourself. And uh, she's going to be my test subject. Let's see how she does. Uh, oh, by the way, the top you can kind of you got like a screw where you can open it, and close it, so you can put how much water you want on there. Okay, bye.